Hello, Buckeye fans. Get ready for some exciting news about the upcoming Ohio State football spring game. In what promises to be a clash of offensive firepower and defensive prowess, this year's game is set to showcase the potential of the Buckeyes' explosive offense against one of the nation's strongest defenses. While the exact roster has yet to be announced, we can expect to see some fresh faces on the field. Keep an eye out for Kansas State transfer quarterback Will Howard, running back Quinshawn Judkins, and talented freshman receiver Jeremiah Smith. And let's not forget about the impact newcomer on the defensive side, Alabama transfer Caleb Downs. But before we continue, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel to receive all the updates on Ohio State football. But that's not all. The spring game will also mark the return of a legendary figure to Ohio Stadium. Former Ohio State football coach Urban Meyer will be in the press box, joining Fox's crew for the game. Meyer, who led the Buckeyes to a national championship in 2014 and maintained an undefeated record against Michigan over seven years, will be calling the game alongside Jason Benetti and Brady Quinn. Joel Klatt and Jenny Taft will provide sideline reporting, adding to the excitement of the event. Now let's shift our focus to the NFL Draft. We all know Marvin Harrison Jr., the talented wide receiver from Ohio State, but there's some buzz around other receivers who could make a splash in the draft. ESPN draft analyst Matt Miller suggests that teams might be favoring Malik Neighbors or Romo Dunzi over Harrison Jr. It all comes down to the specific needs and preferences of each team. Neighbors impresses with his speed and yards after catchability, while Odunzi is a dominant force in contested catches. The draft will certainly bring some surprises, and it will be interesting to see who becomes the first wide receiver taken off the board. Speaking of former Buckeyes, another notable figure is making headlines. Tara Vanderveer, renowned for her coaching success at Stanford, announced her retirement. Before her remarkable tenure at Stanford, she spent five successful seasons at Ohio State, winning four Big Ten Conference championships and reaching the NCAA tournament three times. Vanderveer's impact on women's basketball is immeasurable and her legacy will live on. Now, let's shift gears to something a bit different. Are you a fan of bacon? Well, get ready for a treat. This fall, Ohio State fans will have the opportunity to satisfy their breakfast cravings at Ohio Stadium. A bacon vending machine will be stationed at Section 39A of the South Stands, courtesy of Ohio Pork. Just imagine grabbing a crispy, delicious strip of bacon while cheering on your beloved Buckeyes. That wraps up our exclusive news for today. Now, we want to hear from you, the passionate Buckeye fans. What are your thoughts on the spring game format, the potential new stars on the team, and the other exciting updates we shared? Leave your comments below and let us know what you think. Remember to stay tuned for more thrilling updates on Ohio State football. Until next time, go Buckeyes.